this is a problem that we had already done and this is a pr problem where it's asking us to find uh, critical chi-square left and right values that correspond to the confidence level of 99 percent in a sample size of 22. Our uh, research on table A4 helped us find uh, chi-square L to be equal to 8.034 and chi-square R to be 41.401 what we're going to do is uh, use the calculators uh, with the special programs provided by Rich Anderson and something that you could download from uh, the, our, our class website. But before we do that, what I wanted to do is I want to um, just do a quick sketch of this where you have a chi-square value uh, left and right. And we have to uh, know that with a 99% confidence, we have an area to the right uh, with a 1% left over and half of 1%. We have an area to the right of 0 0.005. And this one has an area to the left of 0 0.005 but then that would make the area to the right of that particular point um, 0.995. So those are two important numbers that we're going to need to remember. We're going to uh, call on the program Inverse Chi-Square, which is a program that you would have uh, downloaded and uploaded, downloaded from our website and uploaded onto your calculator. Uh, the best thing to do is to make sure that you have all these programs installed because this particular program actually relies on ZZINUT. And so if you don't have that installed, you're going to get an error message. Um, so you can choose, pick and choose a handful of these programs to put on your calculator, but it's better to really just dump everything onto your calculator. So let's take our calculators out and hit program and uh, our choice is going to be the inverse chi-square that's to find the critical values so I'm gonna you can arrow down to that or you can just press 2 enter they want the degrees of freedom with a sample size of 22 our degrees of freedom is 21 enter and it's going to ask you to confirm do you want the chi-square critical value you say yes or just press enter and then now they're looking for the area to the right so we're gonna have to do this twice one for the left and one for the right so if we get the left we get an area of uh, 0.995 and when we press enter it says chi squared CV equal sign now it's not complete yet if you look on the upper right hand corner you're going to see a little thinking bar, which is not there anymore. Uh, but that says that your calculator is working things out. So we have 8.033653424. That rounds off to uh, three decimal places, uh, 8.034. So that looks like it's right. Let's run the program again by hitting program and inverse chi-square enter uh, program inverse chi-square so we're going to press enter again say we're going to run the program our degrees of freedom again is 21 we're going to find the chi-square critical value the area to the right this time is 0 0.005 enter and then there's that little thinking bar and when that's finished we're going to get 41 point four oh one rounded off to three decimal places and here it goes forty one point four zero one zero six four seven seven okay so imagine now without having to use table a4 we were able to find the chi-square critical values I think uh, having these programs in your calculator would be very useful for your test.